Can I just ask also, as a, as a recent manager of the England Under-21 squad, Spurs renowned for their academy system, bringing great players through. Uh, from your time and from uh, what you see now, you know, what, kind of, what are the players uh, that are Spurs now that you think have got a real future in the game? I think um, certainly at this moment in time, I would say Tottenham Academy is probably producing as many players as I've ever known, to be quite honest with you. Certainly in my time with England and, and maybe even before that, when you look at the Townsends and the Harry Canes and the Masons of this world that are coming through and doing extremely well, obviously buying players from other clubs, the Danny Roses, buying them at a young age and bringing them into the fold. Um, they've done an outstanding job and as I say the good thing as well they're not afraid to put them into the first team it's all well having a good academy system but you've got to have a manager that's got the confidence as Tim Sherwood did and, and obviously the current manager now of putting them straight into the first team and, and credit to him for that. And uh, you mentioned Harry Kane there, obviously, you know, we're so delighted to have him. And uh, I hear a number of people saying, oh, it could be just a one season wonder thing. You know, from what you see, having seen him live and probably worked with him maybe in your time as well. Uh, you know, do you think it's going to be a one season thing or do you think he's really got it to push on and become a Shearer-esque striker for England and, and uh, uh, you know, for years to come? I think the beauty of Harry is he's very level headed and he's a professional that seems to know exactly where he stands and where he wants to go and what he wants to achieve, you know, and I don't think he's the sort of individual that will get washed away with all celebrity that comes with football this day and age. And I think that in itself will stand him in very good stead. Um, He's going to find it tougher next season than this season. But you've got to understand with Harry, as I saw quite often a few seasons before he went on loan, I rung Harry, must have been four or five years ago now, when he was on loan at Millwall and he had a particularly tough night and I'd never spoke with him before and I rung him and said, listen, this uh, experience you're having at Millwall tonight uh, is going to stand you in real good stead. I didn't think he'd go on to the things that he's gone on to at this moment in time, you know. So, but... Um, he'll keep his feet firmly on the floor because of probably the experience he's had at Millwall and places like that where he's learned his trade a little bit. Brilliant, Stuart. Thanks so much. Really appreciate it. Cheers. Have a good night. You can tell all the fans exactly what was so great about being a Spurs player. What would that be? Um, this was one of the best times of my life. I uh, wish I'd never left the time I did. I 